Uh, hey guys, welcome back for Super Mario Sunshine. Um, yeah, so in the last part, we got to the Gelato Beach and did some stuff in there. Um, I really don't know. Um, yeah, whatever. Uh, let's head through here to get more shine spirits. Uh, episode 3 is Wiggler Ahoy Full Steam Head. Uh, this one's kind of interesting in yeah as soon as it starts you off it's automatically taking place right in the middle of a boss and I have to admit that's something pretty awesome oh crap not me to do that oh jeez um all right Okay, what you want to do here is find the Doomba that he's circling around. Wait until he goes and tries to get close to you. Yeah, and then completely flip him. And then switch the camera. Yeah, just ground pound him like that. I must say, if you've played Mario Kart DS, a Wiggler in that game is a freaking jerk. And I like that, how he just has like a steam train noise there. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. Uh, that could have been my opportunity to flip him there. Uh, I believe he will circle around this one. This is a very random boss fight. <laughs> How I completely missed flipping him there is beyond me. And I still flipped him there. Yeah, even if he runs into this thing, then he'll still get flipped. So, anyways, so we can hit him a second time. I admit that I like his facial reaction when he's hit. I'm actually surprised they didn't incorporate sort of like a Pikmin reference in how whenever like the flowers don't wilt or anything like that. That would have been kind of interesting if they did, but whatever. Uh, how I missed him there is beyond me. And I must say I'm freaking annoyed at seeing a giant sand poop. And of course I fail at even hitting him. Okay, don't go into first person and try to spray him from a distance. That might be a better idea. Okay, that hit him there, but where am I? Holy crap, I went for him. Aw, oh, come on, hit him, hit him. That was my opportunity to hit him and I fell! What? Oh, off screen back up to when I actually am gonna hit him. Alright, so I got a closer arrow this time. It's just this back one again. And whenever he dies. Yeah. Random. Random. I don't know, really. And I don't get why this section over here is where all the stars show up, like. I just don't get it. It's where the sandcastle was, and there's also a blue coin in most missions. If you spray the sand, I guess it doesn't show up. I showed it in the last part, though. It was you have to like spray the ground there, and a shine spray shows up, and then it gives you a blue coin. All right, time for episode five. This or four. Wow, I'm getting mixed up already. <laughs> episode four: The Sandbird is Born. Uh, yeah. Remember. All of these missions seem to follow a chain of events, like starting in episode 2. The first one was that, er, episode 2 there was a Wiggler sleeping on it, and then there was, uh, like the mirrors that, like, had a bunch of cat quack relatives that were just sort of screwing up with the egg and making it completely different. Uh, then Wiggler became a mini boss, and now it's finally. Like, time to enter the Samber.
Uh, what you need to do is just enter that way, and somehow this takes you over to this thing. This thing, admittedly, can be pretty annoying. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, the physics on this thing aren't the best I've seen in a game. Uh, okay then, so I have six out of seven. Uh, there's a lot of blue coins on these things, on this thing. This is where a lot of the blue coins of the level show up in. Uh, don't grab this here, please. Don't grab it. Uh, what you do need to do here is alter yourself so you're on this position here. Uh, kind of like the, um, rotating cubes in, um, Bianco Hills secret levels. This could mirror... This could count as a secret level to some people. I personally don't find it much of one. And then the last uh, red coin I remember is just on top of this tower coming up here. Uh, where is it? We're almost there. Okay, we're here. Okay, sweet, managed to do that coin list, which is actually pretty tough. I am actually surprised I did that on my first take, because I remember Magicious LP, he said that it took him like four tries or something like that, which I think is chaos. Alright, time for episode 5, 2 Piantissimo Sand Sprint. Uh, this is a race mission against a new character in the game, he's uh... As the name suggests, to Piantissimo, but uh, his in Nintendo Power they actually call him El Piantissimo, which is very strange. And uh, actually, I think I'm gonna cheat this race here. Hold on a second, because I never showed it off in a very long time, and I kind of feel like it. Oh, uh, we never really showed it off to the greatest extent. Uh, if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm gonna use the Turbo Nozzle for this. The Turbo Nozzle for this level is located... Um... Where is it located? It's located among... somewhere along the wall. Yeah, you can just sort of do this in order to get up here and... Where is it? Um, the amount of time I'm wasting here is kind of crazy, but... Oh, there it is. Yeah, I knew it was somewhere in this level, and I could also get the rocket nozzle too, but... I don't feel like it. But yeah, so here's the turbo nozzle location for Gelato Beach. And so let's use it. Uh, it does drain quite a bit of water. Um... Not sure if taking it's actually a good idea or not, but whatever. Com completely whipped your record, thank you very much. Holy crap! Wow, that guy's slow. I completely whooped that guy's record even though it wasn't even that in good of a run there. Alright, time for episode 6, Red Coins in the Coral Reef. Uh, this goes down as being a pretty enjoyable mission, I guess. Uh, I think that I'm actually also going to use the Turbo Nozzle for this one. The Turbo Nozzle appears on this back island once you activate it. So, 
whatever. There's a blue point out there in the water, kind of easy to... Well, easy to notice, easy to miss sort of thing. There's some blue coin fish around here, like right there, there's one, and there's also a blue coin up there. There's blue coins pretty much everywhere in this game, and you can also use this as a freaking jet if you want to. There's a blue coin there, which... Whatever, um... Anywho, um... Yeah, uh... This mission can be pretty annoying because of that, which you just saw there. Um, what I meant because... Red be some of the red coins are being carried by red- by fish, and... The fish will often pass right through walls and bring the red coins with them. And because the sit women physics, in my opinion, aren't that good... I must say one thing about Sunshine and Galaxy, I don't really like the swimming physics in either of them, as opposed to 64. Galaxy was okay, because they sort of brought it back, but I found the spin actually rather annoying to use. Okay, there was one that just passed through a wall. Oh, jeez, not a fish. Not a fish, I said. Yeah, the squirt nozzle is completely worthless underwater. Oh, hey there, hey there. Come on, let me get that. Come on, let me get this one here. Just don't. Me. No, don't go through a wall. Don't. You son of a. Bitch. Oh, God. Okay. No, don't you go through a wall either. Oh, my God, this is so annoying. How could that go through that there? This is an annoying mission. And I am hearing a shine sprite that I do not want to be hearing. Oh wow, so I rock it right on past it. Okay, there we go. Finally, I got that stupid thing. Now I have to find another one like that and get it. Oh, I see it now. Get off me, get off me. No, no, you freaking idiot fish. Okay, now where's the last? Oh. Last one's just in here. Okay. Ironicy. And what do you know? I somehow, in recording time, managed to get this mission. This in under 15 minutes. I'm actually really surprised. And, and a rocket right into the shine spray for the win. So, I think we got a pretty good amount done. We uh, got a few more shine sprites in Gelato Beach. Um... I think next time we're probably gonna finish the level up, which is gonna mean the undeniably terrible, atrocious 8th mission of this world. I am not looking forward to that at all. See you guys next time for Mario Sunshine. You will enjoy it.